Does the winter snow have you daydreaming of sunshine and sand? If so, you're not alone. This week, we're heading out of the cold and following our friends at Slick Rock down to beautiful Sand Hollow State Park. We're out at Sand Hollow with the Slick Rock crew. I've been having a blast. Sand Hollow is really cool because you've got a ton of rock crawling stuff, which is similar to uh, like Moab. And then you've got sand dunes, which they're completely contrasting. So two totally different types of riding right in the same area. Um, and then you've got the beach right there, so you can go down and hang out at the beach with your family, uh, swim, jet ski, boat, do all that stuff. With over 15,000 acres of sand dune, beautiful red rock, and miles of trails to suit all types of OHVs and four-wheel drives, this park is a haven for off-roaders. And today, we're starting with the maze, which has become a must-do trail for adventure junkies and daredevil off-roaders. Yeah, first time in the maze. Um, I've driven by it and seen it, but it, they're pretty big obstacles, so I never wanted to do it myself, but we're with a group that's done a ton of rock crawling. So I figure if anybody can spot me the right way, it's these guys, so I gave it a go, and luckily we got up it today. my wife, the maiden voyage uh, from Machine. It had 19 miles on it when we brought it down here, and uh, she's going to do this off the We'll see. Have you done this before? No. What are you thinking? That's a little bit steep. <laughs> this thing can just hold the steering wheel, push the there gas. Go. <laughs> I might be nuts today. Done this one time. That was enough, but <laughs> we might have to do it again today. I'm impressed. Just got done with you. Got to be nuts, and uh, it was awesome. Went well. It's one of those obstacles that. Uh, you're kind of committed what you, once you start. So it was a lot of fun. We had a few people that, that made it up and uh, everybody that tried it made it. Guys, we just got done uh, with the maze. It was, it was awesome. There's some hairy obstacles on that trail, but we had a great time. Everybody got through it. No uh, carnage, nobody broke anything. We had a great time. And now we're going to Plan B. Plan B is an awesome trail. Plan B is a trail that has a little bit of everything with rocks, sand, some challenging parts, and those beautiful sand hollow views. It's a fun trail. It's got a lot of obstacles. It's rated a seven or eight, so there's some really good obstacles. It does have bypasses on some of the more difficult obstacles, so if you want to go around them, you can. But this is an awesome trail. If you want to come out here and get technical, Plan B is a good one. It's not a far drive to get out here. It's pretty easy to get out here and easy to find it. It's a beautiful day down here. It's November. Southern Utah it doesn't get better than this. The red rocks, the sand. I had an awesome time. We're out here in the middle of nowhere driving some trails that honestly these things are they're awesome. Um, they give you enough of a challenge that you need to know what you're doing. So if you've been itching to get outside and get in your rig, then it's time for a trip to Sand Hollow State Park. We're at your leisure. I'm Joe Davis.